Well, there you are. A very good morning to you. It's Sunday the 18th of June. I'm Scotty McClure, and I thought I'd just pop up on Periscope to say hi to you. This is just a quick Periscope promo to say that on Facebook Live tonight at 10 o'clock sharp, 2200 hours British summer time, I shall be broadcasting live for one hour. One hour of superb, scintillating information, education and entertainment and it's all happening for you live on facebook live tonight at 10 o'clock now also there's a few things i need to talk to you about it's been uh, a very very difficult week obviously for so many people in the united kingdom of great britain and northern ireland particularly the uh, dreadful dreadful inferno in london that destroyed the grenfell tower now, how can we prevent this ever happening again? We'll be talking about that tonight on the Scotty McClue Show, live and global right across Facebook. Also, um, we are talking about Father's Day. So, a very happy Father's Day to all the fathers who are around today for Father's Day. And um, I think of my own father, Big Archie, a great chap. I've just posted him with his mother, during World War II on Twitter, so you can see Big Archie and say hello to him there. So we're talking about Father's Day. What does Father's Day actually mean to you? Also, uh, we're looking at, should we have an NHS? Hi, Scott, it looks like the Lib Dems are joining the Tories. Hopefully cannabis will now be made legal. How dreadful. I don't think that's the way we should be viewing society at all. We need fewer drugs lesser of these foreign things to our health and to our system uh, so there we are so anyway we can discuss all that tonight and save thousands of lives from prescription drugs very interesting save the nhs a fortune well we're talking about a new nhs tonight an nhs for dogs nhs for animals how many of you um find it very very expensive if you have to take your dog or your cat or your budgerigar or your cockatoo to the veterinary surgeon. And I think we should have an NHS for this. So that's what we're talking about tonight on the programme. Lots and lots of you can join us. This is just a quick periscope just to let you know what's happening. And um, as I say, it's 10 o'clock sharp. Now, what can you do for me today? I can do for you, I can host a discussion program. Don't worry about my voice. It's uh, it's uh, just a little bit croaky at the moment. There's a little bug going around, but that'll sort itself out. Uh, so there you are. What can uh, you do for me? Today, you can share this broadcast. You can follow me on Periscope. You can follow me on Twitter at Scotty McClure. You can get the link for Facebook Live. Get ready for tonight at 10 o'clock sharp. You can go to gofundme.com forward slash Scotty hyphen McClue and stick some pennies in. What's under the hat? Says somebody. Oh, I keep a lot under my hat. There you are. Hey! Right. There you go. You've seen it now. You've seen it. Um, so that's what's going on there. So join us tonight, 10 o'clock sharp, Scotty McClue, for the Scotty McClue Show live on Facebook Live. Go on to Scotty McClue's YouTube channel and uh, subscribe and follow me on there. Follow me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, follow me live here on Periscope. So lots and lots of you. Right, let's have some tapping of the screens, please. Tap, 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 -ty tap, tap, -ty tap, -ty tap. Let's have some of your beautiful hearts. Come on, let's see the hearts. Up they come. Tap, 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 -ty tap, tap, -ty tap, tap, tap. Is everybody tapping their screen and sending Scotty McClure good wishes and many, many hearts? Very, very important. So there we are. Right, uh, lots to discuss. You can discuss anything within reason. What about your independence? What about my independence? I'm a very independent man. Yes, Scotland should be independent. But I have to say, I've been rather disappointed in one or two nationalists recently because they have been slightly on the anti-royal side. We can never, ever, ever do that. If Scotland or when Scotland becomes independent, which it should do economically, we take the Queen with us. She is our Queen. She is our Sovereign. 
You would miss England. Now, we're looking at economics here, to be quite honest. I love England, as you know. I love Scotland. I love Ireland, Northern Ireland. I love Wales. I don't have a problem. I am in love with the world. But this is pure economics. Scotland needs its own self-determination, run from Edinburgh. All the monies made in Scotland remain and get spent in Scotland on the Scottish people, the Scottish children, on those who have needs, and we create jobs, we strengthen our economy, and we repopulate. So there you go. So that's your independence. Okay, but remember we are under the Queen. Uh, if you love England, you'd stay in the UK. No, not. It's not suitable financially for Scotland, for Scotland to remain in the UK. But we do love England very, very much indeed. We don't have a problem. Uh, so there we go. We're not so keen on the Westminster government at the moment. They are not terribly good for the country. They might be good for a tiny handful of people who have made a few quid, but they're not good for the country. And I was also shocked. It was lovely to see that Billy Connolly got knighted, Sir Billy Connolly, Sir William Connolly. Uh, he got knighted and people were quite unpleasant on social media. Why? The man has done a wonderful job. So we're looking, I'm wondering if a lot of British people are getting too tiny in the mind. That's why you need the Scotty McClue phone in. Very important. Good enough for 12 people. Yes, yes, 12 people. Uh, so there we are. So that's what we're looking at. I also um, was saying this morning, if uh, Mrs. May doesn't want Mr. Corbyn to take over power yet, then uh, she should talk to, uh, to Miss Sturgeon. And, uh, and see what's going on uh, with the SNP rather than going into political quicksand with uh, the DUP in Northern Ireland. All right? I don't think that's a particularly wise way ahead, but then that's just my opinion. However, as you know, Scotty McClue speaks for the nation. What's Mrs. McClue up to? She's making a fool Scottish breakfast. So there we are. A little bit of uh, sliced sausage. Uh, why so many Muslims in the UK? There are Muslims right across the world. And we are part of the world in the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Northern Ireland. And there will be a lot more um, people of different religions joining us. India wouldn't happen anyway. Westminster would be skint. Uh, we're too valuable to them. Yes, absolutely. Bring Mrs. McClue on. Darling, would you like to uh, broadcast on Periscope for the nation? Sounds like she's not too keen about it. No thanks. I think she's watching the temperature of the square slice sausage. We want that to be just perfect for Mr. McClue. So there you are. So that's what we're talking about there. Right. Um, anybody get anything else to say before I push off? And I'll see you all tonight on Facebook Live at 10 o'clock sharp. Be there or be square. Never, ever, ever miss a second of Scotty McClue. Or you miss a moment of life. What else can I tell you? The Silver Jubilee of Scotty McClue is next week, next Monday, a week tomorrow. 25 wonderful, successful years as the Scotty McClue presenter of the Scotty McClue Show. What about that? How tremendous is that? 25 years. Thank you to the wonderful Mike Henfield, the managing director of uh, Red Rose Radio. The news editor, Richard Frediani, who uh, is the news editor of uh, ITN, of, uh, sorry, ITV News. ITV News, which used to be ITN, of course. And um, also John Miles, the wonderful John Miles, who was the programmer at the time. So there we are, went on to run radio stations. Right, I shall push off. Uh, somebody has eaten my mince, says some silly boy, who has just been blocked. Oh, bye-bye. So there we are, any silly stuff. And of course, you get blocked. So there we go. And I believe there's mince for lunch, talking of mince. So very, very good. Right, uh, have a lovely, lovely Sunday. All right. And uh, as I say, I'll see you all at 10 o'clock sharp. Get on to uh, Scotty McClure's social media. Follow me on Twitter. Follow me on Facebook. Do you still do live radio? Not at the moment, but we're doing live television 
on Facebook Live and on here on Periscope. So you can come on and join us there. And hopefully somebody will uh, waken up in live radio and say, this country needs a phone-in, needs a national phone-in. Had we had one, then people wouldn't have been so surprised by the election outcome because we would have talked on the Scotty McClure show. Right, uh, I'll catch up with you later. Dinky-doo, have a wonderful day. Scotty McClure is now going to broadcast live on Facebook Live with the promo for tonight's show. Come and join me.